Hey brothers and sisters, this is a quick message about armoring up, keeping the full armor of God on daily. It is so important that we resist the wiles of the devil in these last days because he is really attacking. He's really on the attack because he knows that his time is short and he knows that we are out there spreading the word, spreading the gospel and sounding the alarm. Pastor Jack Hibbs said it so perfectly when he said, this world is not our home. We are in enemy territory. The the unbelieving world, they don't understand that we are in a spiritual battle. They cannot see it. They cannot sense it. They cannot understand it. But we who are in Christ, we feel it. We sense it. We acknowledge it. We understand a small portion of it. I mean, we see the through a glass darkly so we don't see the full picture as of this moment but we do understand that there is a spiritual battle going on we do see our brothers and sisters suffering we do understand that we are not home we are in enemy territory and we need to armor up and how do we armor up how do we resist the wiles of the devil we need to go to the word for that Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about, seeking whom he may devour. 1 Peter 5.8 So just stay in the word daily, brothers and sisters. Be in prayer daily. Be close to the Lord. Put on the whole arm of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to withstand in the evil day. And having done all to stand, stand therefore, having your loins girt about with the truth, and having on the breastplate of righteousness, and your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Above all, taking the shield of faith, wherewith ye shall be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked, and take the helmet of salvation, and the sword of the Spirit, which is the word of God, praying always with all prayer and supplication in the Spirit, and watching thereunto with all perseverance and supplication for all saints. Ephesians 6, 11-18 So we just need to keep on putting on the full armor of God daily to resist the wiles of the devil. Read the word daily. Be in prayer daily. Pray for the saints. Pray for the persecuted. Pray for Israel. Just... Pray for whatever God puts on your heart. And this last message, the pieces of the puzzle are coming together. Jesus is coming soon. We see it through a glass darkly. So we don't see the full picture, but we just see little pieces of the puzzle coming together. And we know that Jesus is coming soon. We are in the season. We will know the season. The Bible is very clear on that. So we are seeing the day approaching. And so we need to just continue to armor up. We need to continue sounding the alarm, spreading the gospel, and encouraging one another in these last days. We know that Jesus is coming soon, and we just need to continue to armor up and just stay strong. God bless you all.